Overseas now, where a 48-year-old American and former Marine is in custody in Russia, accused of being a spy. His family says he's innocent and that he was there to attend a wedding, and now the State Department is involved. ABC's James Longman with the details coming in. Tonight, the family of Paul Whelan speaking out. The former Marine placed under arrest in Moscow, accused of being a spy. The only goal, the only idea we have is to get him back. David Whelan says his brother was in Russia last week for a wedding and had toured Moscow with friends the Friday he vanished. We realized that something had gone wrong um, and that Paul wasn't where he was supposed to be. But no one knew where he was. On Sunday, friends filed a missing persons report. Then Russian security services put out the statement yesterday saying they have initiated a criminal case against a U.S. citizen under Article 276 of the Criminal Code of the Russian Federation. Article 276, espionage. Tonight, he's being held by authorities in Russia, but his brother firmly denies the allegations. There's no chance that Paul was engaged in espionage in, in Russia. The 48-year-old heads up security for a Michigan-based auto parts company, but has a checkered past in the U.S. Armed Forces. After two tours in Iraq, he was discharged for larceny. A self-professed Russophile, Whelan was active on Russian social media. Spy scandals have long been part of the theatre of U.S.-Russia relations. This arrest comes just two weeks after the guilty plea of confessed Russian agent Maria Butina, who admitted to infiltrating Republican political circles to influence U.S.-Russia relations. No word yet from the State Department whether or not they've spoken to Whelan. The charges against him are serious, and if convicted, he could spend a minimum of 10 years in prison. Tom? James Longman for us tonight. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.